Welcome to the REI Foundation Podcast, where we cover all the steps and strategies to make your real estate dreams a reality. Now your hosts, Jason and Peely. Well, hello again. Welcome to another edition of the Real Estate Investing Foundation Podcast. It is Multifamily Monday and coming off just working on our investment summary and putting together our documents with our securities lawyer, we thought it would be an ideal time to talk about just why it is necessary and most important to have the right team members on your team, specifically lawyers, right? You're going to be now dealing with the security if you're now in a syndication. You're going to be bringing on investors in a passive environment where you're going to be offering them security in uh, terms of the offering presented for the apartment building that you're going to be bringing to the table. And having the right securities lawyer on your side who's able to protect you and put together the right pieces to, one, make this investment successful, but also help you now cover all the bases that need to, be, need to happen is very, very important, to, to say the least. So for you, you need to be specific what you want and then ask questions of that lawyer. Have they done this type of work before? Are they familiar with this type of work? Uh, do they invest themselves? What are their suggestions going to be on the offering? Are they going to look through your summary? Where do they start and where they, do they stop? Are, are they going to help you form the entities, uh, your LLCs or your partnerships? Where are they going to stop and start? And are they going to do your filings? All this is important because ideally, if, if they're not doing it, either you or not, someone else is going to have to do it. So finding out your lending partner, how it's going to work, because this time to be able to create the PPM is time that you can't officially have investors be signed up and now having money come to be able to close the deal. So if you need to close a deal in, in 45 days and you don't have this lawyer set, and now you're thinking about what you need to do, you don't really know the questions to ask, you're trying to put this uh, lawyer in place, and this lawyer now has a lot of questions, a lot of information you're going to need from you about your deal about your team members, about uh, yourself, about your, your lending environment. It's all going to have to get wrapped up into the paper we're going to prepare. It may take them four or five weeks to create this. So now if you have to close in 45 days, and now you have to take four or five weeks to be able to have this paperwork come back to you. And when you get this paper back, paperwork back to you that's 110 pages, 120, 130 pages, you're now going to have to be able to Give this to your investors, allow them adequate time to be able to peruse it, go through it, go through it with their lawyers, go through it with their significant others to understand it, come back with questions, and then get this signed and back over to you. All before you can able to fund, you can see how this can become a very difficult thing in timing. So for you, make sure you have the right team members in place. Have these conversations prior to getting into the deal so you know what's going to be needed, the steps are going to be needed, what they're going to do for you when this actually gets to the point that you find this great deal. And that's how you be successful. Set yourself up for everything that's going to happen because so many things are going to happen that you don't expect. You don't want the things that you can control to be the ones that are really now hanging you up. Okay. Happy Monday. Bye now. Thanks for tuning into the REI Foundation Podcast. Check back next time for more awesome tips and strategies to launch your new you in real estate.